I am Mark, and this is my journey through tarot. Come with. Okay, so we're going to take a trip here to San Fe Beach. So we're just going around the roundabout here, which I'm amazed it's gone so easily because usually people don't have a clue how to get around this thing. To the left, if you can see it, there's a lot of boats parked out there, big tourist boats. You're not going to see it, but on the way back you will. Uh, <laughs> and uh, they actually go out into this uh, bay and out onto the Gulf of Mexico, uh, emptied out where uh, I'll be on the beach. So, a little shortcut I take here. Everybody else likes to go the long way around, but uh, here I go through the back neighborhood and then uh, you know, I've slipped in. Here's a little boat slip that you can see to the left. Okay, but we're going straight. And we're going to cut off, I don't know, probably about seven or eight blocks because of this little back road. It cuts across about four blocks and then over about seven. So it's a tidy little uh, shortcut. We're almost there. Now we're coming over the second uh, causeway. This is the Sand Key Causeway uh, just after this big uh, hotel here on the right. We're going to pass an open parking lot and then we're going to right up, right up onto the uh, freeway and uh, up to the Sand Key Causeway. Be careful here. Now I love going up here because just at the top, as you start to look over, I'm looking to the right now, but as you start to look over the opposite direction, on the left, you can actually see many times people uh, sailboarding. I knew no island over there called Sandy Foot Island. And this piece of beach to the left is where you can actually drive out and park your car and just step out of your car onto the beach. It's a very small little strip of beach, it's not near that left. Past the fire station on the right, the sailing club across the way there. And we're going to turn right into the Sand Key State Park. <laughs> Here we are, it's beautiful, my typical spot. Don't ask me who that was, I don't know. But uh, I just like to uh, walk along. Okay, that's enough. I mean, starfish perfectly formed in the middle of the beach. I just happen on it. Never happened. That's some video footage I picked up somewhere. I don't know, free software. But, uh, okay. I guess this is just a little too obvious that it's not really happening. But it's a nice scene. And honestly, something you can see almost any day out here on this real beach. <laughs> There's my dune I usually park in front of or behind. Today I'm in front of it. Pretty soon it'll be time to pack up and get back because uh, only about an hour is all I can do. Uh, when it's a little bit cooler, yeah. But, so now we're heading back. I'm going back around my special neighborhood um, to take a shortcut. Nobody does this. I don't know why, but you just go to the end of this road. There's a uh, boat slip in front of us. It's an amazing apartments or condos. Take a left right here. I'm going to zoom down this little street, well, 25 miles an hour. Now, to the right, here's those boats, those tour boats. Back around the, um, the little roundabout here, which again confuses so many people. I don't know why they can figure out how to use the roundabout. We're headed up to the opposite side of the, uh, the uh, this is the Clearwater Causeway. On the way home, palm trees everywhere. This is Florida. You weren't sure. So, neat little piece of life. I can't believe I'm back. I've never thought I'd leave Florida again. But, here I am. So, good real. Clearwater. By the way, Scientology. 